JTAG Vega 3900 also supports the multi-subnet feature. It can isolate the different LAN groups by the different VLAN IDs to prevent the inappropriate data transmission between work groups. The configuration step is you go to LAN and choose General Setup. Then you can assign the different VLAN IDs to each LAN. Then you go to Switch. Use the AO 2.1Q VLAN to define each VLAN ID's authorized data packet path. In ABC Company Story, we can separate the four level buildings by different LAN with the different LAN VLAN ID. Then I will show you the configuration. Setup. In the General Setup tab, we click A to create a profile for each LAN. For example, LAN 1 with its IP address, we can assign its VLAN ID as 10. Then you do the similar configuration with different IP address and different VLAN ID. So you can use the VLAN IDs to set the AO2.1Q VLAN. For the AO2.1Q VLAN, you should go to Switch and choose AO2.1Q VLAN tab. For example, when you click Add, for the VLAN ID tab, you can let its member only for the LAN one, so it cannot communicate with other subnets. And hit Apply. Another handy feature is you can use the different subnet to create a different IP object. So you don't have to create the different IP object by different employees IP address and use those predefined subnets to create different IP object.